Well, thank you, Josh, and it is good to be here at the Kennedy Space Center. Uh, we are obviously in the media room where we have had many conferences before. Um, you know, I remember fondly Demo 1. I remember fondly the launch abort test, and this room was absolutely packed. Um, and here we are today uh, in an empty room talking to cameras, um, and all of us are six feet apart. And of course, we all walked in here with our masks on. And, um, and of course, what we are doing here today exemplifies um, what we were doing in the, in the launch readiness review. Um, so these are different times. But it is also a time when we need to be doing amazing things as a nation and inspiring the entire world. And that's what we're doing. Uh, the flight readiness review is complete. We have another milestone under our belts. Um, it was a good review, great discussion. Um, I think everybody in the room was very clear that now is the time to speak up if there are any challenges, um, and, and there were. Uh, there were conversations that were had that were very important to be had. But it's also true that at the end, um, as, as, as each system and subsystem was considered, um, at the end we got to a go. So, um, so we, are, we are now preparing for a launch in, in five short days. So. Um, I want to say it's good to be here at the Kennedy Space Center. Um, there's a, a lot of work left to do. Uh, the launch is on, or the rocket is on the pad, and uh, we've got a static fire in front of us, or I should say a hot fire in front of us, as well as um, a lot of checks to do. But, um, but the, uh, the launch readiness review was good, and, um, and we are a go.